Welcome back to JSA TV, where we're covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from leaders in digital infrastructure. I'm Buffy Harakidis of JSA, and we are live from Data Cloud Global Congress in beautiful Cannes, France. And joining me today is Scott Willicks. He is the VP of Sales for the EMEA region for Submer. Scott, welcome. Your very first time on JSA it TV. Is. Be gentle. Yeah. Honor having you here today. I mean, we're here day two at Data Cloud Global, the 20th anniversary yep. of this amazing conference. The floor is absolutely buzzing. It's the biggest Fantastic. conference for Data Cloud today. And we're going to talk a little bit more about Summer. And they also have a big anniversary coming up, a milestone of a decade, 10 years uh, in October, which is just a few months away, believe yep. it or not. Uh, what does your team have in store to celebrate? Oh, well, certainly as part of the the ten year anniversary, we're going to we're going to continue our growth plan. So we've now recently just opened the R and D facility in Taiwan, which is fantastic. Op doors opened for that last month, uh, and we're by the end of the year, the, the production facility in Houston should be fully on stream and online. And we've also expanded into our sales presence into the Middle East. So continuing growth is the theme for the 10th anniversary. Okay, keep it growing for yeah. 10 years, which is a huge milestone in yeah, the industry absolutely. today uh, to make it a decade and to continue with the strategic growth plan yeah. that Summer has. And you also have some recent news well, that we, I hear some big news uh, that you'd like to discuss. Why don't you tell us and viewers a little bit more? Okay. Well, we've also completed a recently our rebranding exercise, and that was really to coincide with some additional pillars we've added to the Submer business structure. So initially, our first focus was all about working out the use cases for a liquid cooling and developing products and ecosystem that supported its deployment. What we've now added in the, in the recent rebranding exercise was two additional pillars. So we now have our design and build team, which will focus on a modular, fast to market type approach. So another string to the bow. And we'll also be looking to build our own data center and offer that as a, a, a AI as a service solution. So we're certainly morphing into more than just a manufacturer of cooling solutions. We're a much more rounded business now. So that's the way we'll be heading in the future. The future is bright for summer, it sounds like, uh, especially with adding those pillars to your already existing uh, strategic yep. pillars of your company's plan for sure. Is there anything else that you wanted to add today or uh, tell viewers about summer? Uh, well, certainly it's, it's the whole change of the feel in, in summer at the moment, you know, it is the move towards these additional pillars. And it is a very exciting time for building our own DC allows us to really showcase how you go about designing a hybrid DC and really showing people how you can deploy it and see the benefits from it. So it's a great example for us to bring customers along and show them it and show how you can really use and deploy that. There's a number of successes that we're already starting to have. So we now have POC deployments in Rome, Milan, uh, and the UK within the last couple of months and in Egypt and Cairo. So liquid cooling is definitely becoming a reality. It's no longer just something that people talk about. Yeah, I mean, it was a concept, and now uh, it's there's no other way. Correct, correct. That's right? the way we're going. It is a reality. Now. Yeah, it is definitely a reality. Um, why don't you tell viewers where to go if they want to learn more about, see that rebrand, learn more about these big developments, find out about that big 10-year anniversary plan coming this fall? Well, certainly the, our marketing team are in full flow at the yeah. moment. So watch this space for information on that. And customers are more than welcome to come and visit our facility in Barcelona. We've recently completed a brand new customer experience center. So customers want to come and see immersion tanks in the flesh, more than welcome to. And if they want to talk about design and build and looking at how we can do that in a fast scale way, more than happy to have those discussions with them as well. And the website? Uh, yes, the website is now fully updated with the rebranding. The marketing team are extremely proud of it. So we would suggest everybody has a look at the new Submer website. Lots of new and exciting information on there. Definitely. And that's Submer.com? Yes, Submer.com. Right. It looks great. And we're so honored to have you here today for the very first time on JSA TV. And thank you, viewers, for tuning in to another episode of JSA TV from Data Cloud, Global Congress in Cannes, France. Happy networking.